Hi, I'm Reza and welcome to Be Kami. So today we're going to do a makeup tutorial on this look and for me this is a graduation look because March is finally around the corner and everyone is graduating! Yay! Before I start, please don't forget to subscribe to their YouTube channel, Be Kami, and to my personal channel, Reza Ang. graduation makeup you have to keep it really glowy, natural, simple, fresh. Kasi pipicturan talaga kayo ng parents niyo and your friends. So, feel ko, it really has to be heavy para mag all day long. So, I'm starting off with a primer and I'm using the Too Faced Hangover Primer. Primer is really important because it makes your makeup last. So, I'm just gonna put some on my fingers and then I'll press it on my face. And then we have to use some lip balm to moisturize the lips. So I'm just using the Glossier Balm.com in the shade Birthday. This is just a clear lip balm. And then for foundation, I'm just gonna use this. This is the NARS All Day Weightless Foundation. And it's yung pili kong foundation. Kasi sobrang long lasting niya. This is a liquid foundation and full coverage siya. So perfect for graduation day. So gonna mix this and then and then I'm just gonna use a damp beauty blender to blend it so. and then now we're moving on to concealer and this is the Maybelline fit me concealer so good because it really covers up to all your imperfections and for graduation day dapat wala yung mga yan. so I'm just gonna put this on my problem areas Then we have to set everything with the setting powder. So I'm just going to use this one. This is the Makeup Forever Setting Powder. It's translucent. And it's really important to set your foundation and concealer so that you don't cake your makeup. Mo. So I'm just going to use a big brush and then put that over my face. Then let's move on to the brows. So I'm just using this. This is the Anastasia Dip Pro Pomade in Dark Brown. And for brows, tapat on fleek yan on your graduation day. So I'm just gonna use this angled brush to fill my brows in. Then we're just gonna use a brow mascara to seal the deal in. Para in place na yung eyebrows mo the whole day. So this is the Glossier Boy Brow. And I'm just gonna swipe this all over my brows. done and also remember guys that brows are sisters but they are not twins so okay let's move on to the eyes now but before you put on some eyeshadow we have to prime the eyelids first so I'm just gonna use the same concealer from Kanina this is the Maybelline fit me concealer again then I'm just gonna blend it again with a beauty blender and then we're just gonna set that again with the same setting powder So for eyeshadow, I'm just going to use one palette and this is the Modern Renaissance palette from Anastasia Beverly Hills. So I super love this palette. It's so beautiful colors niya here. So yeah. So I'm starting off with the lightest shade. Uh, it's Tempera. It's this one. So I'm just going to put that all over my eyelids. That's going to be my shadow base. Then I'm just gonna use this color, it's the burnt orange. Then I'm just gonna start from the outside corner, then work my way through the inner corner. Then I'm just gonna use this gold shimmery color, it's the Primavera. And personally, I like to use my fingers, I think they work better, but it's up to you if you wanna use a brush. So, me, I'm just gonna use my fingers. So, I'm gonna dab this here. And then I'm just gonna put that on my lid. Then next, I'm gonna use this color. It's the red okra. And then I'm just gonna put that on my outer corner.
Then I'm taking this color, the antique bronze, and then I'm just gonna put that on the outer lash line. Then for the lash line, I'm just gonna take some of that burnt orange again. Then I'll just sweep that over my lash line. Then I'll just take some of this glittery pink shade. It's called Vermeer. And then I'm just gonna put that on the inner eyelids to make my eyes pop and sparkle. So. Then for eyeliner, I'm just gonna use this Korean eyeliner. I got this from the department store. It's a newborn eyeliner and it's brown. So. I really love eyeliner because it makes your eyes pop and especially for a girl like me, sobrang late ng mata ko, so I really need eyeliner to make my eyes look bigger. So Okay, so we're done with eyeliner and then I'll just run that over with another eyeliner. This is the Kat Von D Tattoo Liner and this is black. So I'll just run it over to make it more bold. And then for falsies, if you want to wear falsies, that's perfectly okay. I suggest you do because it will really emphasize your look. But if you're like me who hates falsies because sobra nangangati off from them, I suggest you use this. <laughs> this is the best mascara on earth. This is the Maybelline Hyper Curl Volume Express Mascara. So I'm just going to use this and then I'm just going to curl my lashes first. Okay, when you're done with the eyes, let's put on some bronzer to brighten up the skin and add some color. So I'm using the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer. To make it easy for you, you can do a number three. So. Okay, after bronzer, time to put some color on the cheeks. So I'm just gonna use this e.l.f. blush palette. And then I'm gonna use this color right here. So... So moving on to highlighter, I'm just gonna use this Fenty Beauty highlighter. This is the Kilowatt highlighter in the shade Crystal Fire and Lighting Dust. So I feel like this is a good highlighter for graduation because it's not that shiny, so it's okay. So I'm just gonna mix the two and then put some on my cheekbone. After highlighter, I'm just gonna add some more bronzer and then bronze my neck. Then for a finishing powder, I'm just going to use this powder. This is the Hourglass Lighting Powder. And then I'm just going to get some and then put this all over my face. Lastly, for some lip action. So when you think of graduation, what comes into my mind is a natural, peachy, glowy look. So I'm just going to use this. It's one of my favorite lipsticks. It's the Matte Velvet Teddy from MAC. And then I'm just going to put this on my lip. Okay, and if you're a fan of matte lipsticks, and I guess you could end your makeup there, but me, I super love glossy lips, and I feel like for graduation, I'm swaggy and glossy. So I'm just gonna use this Fenty Beauty lip gloss, and then I'm just gonna put that over this. And of course, don't forget to spray some setting spray to make sure that your makeup lasts all day and all night. So. So that's it, we're done. Before I say bye, I just want to say congratulations to everyone who's finally graduating. And thank you so much guys for watching. Plus, please don't forget to subscribe to their YouTube channel. It's Be Kami and my YouTube channel, Reza Ang. So that's it, bye!